Welcome once again to our Men of Platinum Presents Direct Hit, where we pick a standout player from the day's play, one who had an indomitable spirit and unwavering values, just like Platinum. And I think for these Lucknow Super Giants games now, we can almost guess who it'll be. But let me not give it away just yet. RCB have gone down again at home. I've got Mitch McClanagan and Varun Aaron with me. Before I get to the point where you tell me who you've picked as your man of platinum, gentlemen, let's uh, do a quick fire review of the game. Mitch, let me start with you. Uh, what is the biggest issue that Bengaluru need to fix? Uh, just consistency of where their batters are batting. Uh, their bowlers as well, they've changed them around a lot where they come into the game. So just trying to be a little bit more consistent in their lineup. All right. Uh, Varun, do Lucknow look like one of the best balance sides of the league so far? Absolutely. Uh, they, they look really, really good in all departments. Um, their fast bowling is second to none at the moment with Mayank Yadav firing on all cylinders. Their spin with Ravi Bishnoi has always been good. Uh, Siddharth is really bowling well. Uh, Kunal Pandya is obviously one of the stable guys. Uh, batting Quinton Decock's coming good, and we know when Quinton Decock comes good, he can just take the way away. Sorry, take the game away from uh, from the opposition. Uh, so yeah, I mean they look one of the best sides at the moment, but it's a long season ahead. Mm. All right, Mitch, were the drop catches in the RCB mm. innings the turning point of this game? Well, they were significant. They clawed the game back in their favour. They had 15 runs scored off 22 balls during the middle phase, and and Quinton de Kock was struggling at the boundaries. And uh, Reese Topley bowled a beautiful back of the hand slower ball to Nicholas Poran when he was on three, and that was probably the most significant drop catch. Uh, that was rub up with the with the gloves behind the stumps, and yes, and you'd expect them two. you'd expect them to take that. So he went on to get another 40 runs, and. And that was the difference in the game at the end of the day. Yeah, when I say RCB innings, of course, I meant the first innings when RCB were bowling after winning the toss. Very quickly, last question. Varun Aaron, should India be considering Mayank Yadav for the World Cup? Definitely should be in the scheme of things. Uh, it's a long tournament again. Uh, he has to be fit for the whole for the whole tournament, be there at the end. Uh, the They also have to review how the other bowlers are, are, are going to go because they've been putting in a lot of work in a lot of Indian tournaments. Like, for India in a lot of tournaments. Mm. So there, there are a lot of things to, to consider, but definitely he's in the scheme of things and he's in the conversation. Mm. All right. And as he's picked up uh, for the first time ever in the history of the league, a player of the match award in your first two games in IPL cricket. Gentlemen, is it fair to say that we can persevere uh, with Mayank Yadav as our man of platinum? Yep. He's as rare as platinum gets because he's bowling at 150 clicks plus every single game. Quite a few balls, so I mean, those kind of bowlers are rare, yeah. like platinum. Well, I mean, he's got the chain already, doesn't he? You, you might see him with a couple of bracelets in the next couple of games. Yeah. So, you know, so when these speedsters who have got that little flair about them start <laughs> start <laughs> cranking it up and winning man in a match uh, games, you, yeah. you see the jewelry added to their uh, their attire. So, right, uh, the self belief that he has at this young age, you know, it's a value as rare as platinum. The courage to bowl. And, at a ground like the Chinnaswamy as well, that's another value, courage as rare as platinum. Uh, but we are seeing something different. It's not like a f young fast bowler who has one good game and then, you know, sprays it around the next. There is something unique about Mayank Yadav. I think the most unique thing about Mayank Yadav is his speed off the deck. There have been a lot of 150 bowlers, you know, but sometimes they go for a bit of tap because they're not that fast off the wicket. He's he's uh, he's got that whip at the end of his action, which mm. gives him that speed off the deck, and that's what's surprising people. Yeah. It's not like it's not like Maxi's never played a, a delivery above 150 in his life. I've seen him smack people bowling 155 yeah. plus, you know. But for him to just like get rushed on that one, it's more speed off the wicket. So I think Mayanki Yadav's USP is obviously speed, but his bigger USP is speed off the wicket. Mm. Yeah, I, I spoke about pre-show about him, what I thought might be rocks of diamonds today uh, on that ground and and he proved me wrong. He, he showed that he was all diamonds mm. um, and I think it's very rare to see someone with such um, accuracy and, and it was high quality and like you say, the courage to do repeat what he did at home and luck now uh, at, at the Chinnaswamy mm. was sensational. Yeah, I'll go one step further, not just diamonds but diamonds in, with platinum around. Mm. That's a good combination. Yeah. Thank you very yeah, much, Varun Aaron, Mitch McClanagan. Mayank Yadav, he just looks a million dollars. He is fittingly once again featuring as our man of platinum. This was our man of platinum presents directed.